thanks, Bree. The death of a local bobcat is sparking conversation on how to better protect wildlife. Newswave's 32 reporter Christian Parham has the details on the plan to provide safe passage for animals in the mountains. This bobcat survived the Woosley fire only to be struck and killed last Friday in a car crash in Calabasas. E361, an adult male, was fatally struck by a driver on Las Virginas Road. Wildlife experts say vehicles are the second leading cause of death for local bobcats. At least 18 mountain lions have been killed by drivers in the area since 2002. Pepperdine student Megan Jaycox said she has encountered wildlife while driving near the canyon. There was a deer crossing the canyon and it was on one of the curves, so I thought it was really dangerous for both of us. Plans are in the works to build a wildlife crossing bridge that would allow big cats to move freely across the 101 and 405. But it is unclear when this plan will come to fruition as wildlife advocates will need to raise 60 million by 2020 for the bridge. I think that would be very helpful, not only for the animal's sake, but it's a very dangerous spot to have animals crossing. Park rangers are advising canyon drivers to be careful when driving and keep an eye out for crossing wildlife. 